this is a Whirlpool washing machine, and the problem is that uh, it won't drain after the agitation, <clears throat> and it gets a error message, which in the manual says that it uh, has clogged up drain lines, possibly. Determine that it's probably the drain pump or the water lines, so we have to take the machine apart in order to get to the pump down at the bottom. Here's the machine here. We've got the front door off and we got the pump here. And so we took the machine apart and this is the old drain pump here. And here's the filter which came out of here. This uh, front part, this broke off there. But this goes in there and then you unscrew it and then you take the filter out. And you can see here the uh, filter is all clogged up. It's got this uh, plastic kind of a rubbery material there and then uh, also there's a screw stuck down inside the side of it when I tried to pull this thing out it wouldn't come out and uh, the front part broke off and then I used a screwdriver to pry this out and then it finally came out and that screw was holding it in here's the uh, new uh, drain pump here and uh, I looked in the service manual they say it gives two minutes to drain the water. If the water doesn't drain in two minutes, then the uh, control board senses the uh, delayed time and then it shuts the machine down. And then it gives an error message that indicates that uh, the lines are clogged up. And in this case, it's the filter. If you look at the pump, it's got one, two, three, four screws to hold it in. And then there's a wire uh, coupling right there. And then uh, first thing I do is I put soap around here so this will slide in easily. This goes up under there. So the machine seems to be working all right. We replaced the drain pump and it seems to be going through the wash and rinse and drain cycles now. And we're not getting the F1 error message. Okay, thanks for watching.